What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another tech tip and in today's video I'm going to show you how to optimize your solid state drive. Check it out. Just a quick reminder, this is for solid state drives, so if you're looking for something to defrag your hard drive, go ahead and click on this video up here in the corner, and that'll show you our video on how to defragment a hard drive. Otherwise, let's get started. The first thing that we're going to want to do before we actually begin optimizing your solid state drive is let's actually determine if you have one installed if your computer in your computer. If you are unsure, what you can actually do is go down into the start menu, and this will work on Windows 10. Windows 7, Windows 8, 8.1, and just start typing the word device. And an option that's gonna come up under the control panel is device manager. Go ahead and left click on device manager. And a new window is going to pop up. And if you need to, go ahead and enlarge this window. But the main thing that we're looking for is the option that says disk drives. What this is, is this is going to show us uh, what drives are attached or what is connected to your computer as far as hard drives or solid state drives. So go ahead and click on the arrow on the left hand side there. And it's going to give you a little drop down. As you can see right here, I do have a Samsung SSD installed in the computer and then I've got some normal hard drives on here. Typically an SSD is going to say SSD next to it to indicate that it is a solid state drive. So once you have determined if you have a solid state drive or a hard drive, like I said, you're going to want to make sure that you're going to do the appropriate optimization. If you do have a solid state drive, go ahead and continue. If not, if you do have a hard drive, be sure to actually look and watch our uh, how to defrag our, defragment our hard drive video. So we've determined that we've got a solid state drive on here. So I'm going to go ahead and close this window. Um, also pay attention to your manufacturer on the drive. In this case, it's a Samsung. So you're going to use a software called Sam Samsung Magician for any type of Samsung SSD. If you have a different manufacturer, make sure you visit the manufacturer's website and download the optimizing tool for that specific manufacturer's solid state drive. So I'm going to go ahead and close this out. Now that we've got kind of the fluff out of the way, I'm going to go ahead and open up Samsung Magician. You may get a little uh, user account controls. Go ahead and click yes or run, allow, whichever applies. And as you can see, once I've opened up the program, it's gonna scan for any type of drive information on the actual computer. Once the software has loaded, you're gonna actually get some very similar information. Now your software may look a little bit different depending on which manufacturer you have, but relatively it will give you all the same type of information. So cool thing about the software is of course we can go through, we can optimize the drives, we can do like secure erase or forensic wipe. So if you're giving the, the solid state drive to somebody else for whatever reason, you can come down, click on secure erase, and it'll go through and make sure everything is erased properly. Of course, we'll go over performance optimization here in a moment. Uh, performance benchmark, you can actually see how well your solid state drive is performing. And then of course, if you have any kind of system, ca uh, system compatibility issues, you can check that here as well. One thing I also want you guys to pay attention to is the smart status of your solid state drive. What this does to break it down, it basically gives you indication on if sectors of your certain of your solid state drive are healthy or if they're bad or anything like that. So uh, with solid state drives over time, as it read and writes to the drive, they do have a lifespan. Now it's not anything to worry about, but you can go in and you can actually check it under the smart status. So if we left click on that, you can actually see it goes through and kind of gives you a description of all the different types of sectors or uh, partitions, not partitions, but uh, parts of the drive. And you can say, see the status right over here, it says okay across the board. So that just indicates that my uh, solid state drive is in good condition. There's nothing wrong with it. Everything's working as should. So we're gonna go ahead, click on performance optimization. And it's gonna give you, you may get a little breakdown of what they do or what process does what. Advanced mode rearranges data of the solid state for optimal performance and reliability. This process may take a few minutes. It is recommended that you do not perform any other operations until the process is completed. So whenever you're defragmenting a hard drive or optimizing a solid state drive, you do not want to be using the computer while it's doing that to make sure that it can actually perform and uh, optimize it the best that it can. So what we're gonna do after we've clicked on that, I'm gonna go ahead and click start on this. And then once we're done with that, I will return the video and uh, we'll come back after. Perfect, and so the SSD optimization just finished, as you can see, the speed of this will depend on the actual hardware of your actual computer. As you can see, this particular instance took about 46 minutes to do. Hey guys, thanks for watching that tech tip. If you found the information useful or you liked it, be sure to leave any kind of comment or feedback in the comment section below the video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and we will see you next time.